Welcome to Smart Health Treasure. Yoga is a great mood enhancer that requires no drugs or medications. Like all forms of exercise, yoga releases hormones that help ease feelings of stress that often lead to the blues or outright depression. Being active keeps your mind away from negative thoughts and allows you to gain a greater and clearer perspective on the problems you are facing. People who are depressed or simply feeling down often lack the motivation to exercise. That's why yoga can be such a great option. It takes far less effort to complete yoga routine as it takes to out to a video or drive to the gym. A word of warning, if you suffer from more than just the occasional bout of the blues and feel down for more than two weeks at a time, you should seek professional advice. A doctor or therapist may feel that you need a combination of medication or therapy with exercise. When you're feeling down, it's hard to think positively. People who are depressed often lack the concentration to detach themselves from their thoughts. Yoga is a moving meditation, so it is easier to take your mind away from negative thoughts. Our essential inner nature can be blocked by negative thoughts. Apathy, despair, doubt, hopelessness and sleeping too much or too little are all signs of depression that must be addressed. Yoga is designed to bring you closer to your inner truth, naturally helping with some of the symptoms of depression. With a focus on balance, yoga can help to restore mental stability. There is a definite connection between mind, body and spirit that indicates people can beat the blues with yoga. No other form of exercise alone can achieve these same benefits. Certain asana yoga postures can influence your mood and help to relieve depression, although asana can cure depression altogether. Asana postures can help increase low energy levels and relieve lethargy. They are also helpful in opening lung capacity to allow more oxygen to reach all parts of your body and even your mood. Ask your yoga instructor to help you learn the postures that will balance your moods. It's also possible to beat the blues with yoga because of the calming effects yoga has on the nervous system. Proper breathing techniques are important elements to practicing yoga, as these can help curb your anxiety and quiet your thoughts, allowing you to concentrate on positive rather than negative energies. As you learn more about yoga, you'll come to understand the connection between your mind and your emotions, and you'll find that they can help each other. If you think you may be suffering with severe depression, seek professional advice. Yoga is a drug-free alternative that can be safely practiced in conjunction with any medication or therapy your doctor orders. Some yoga routines are specifically designed to alleviate depression and taught by instructors who have been extensively trained to understand the most therapeutic positions. Even performing the most basic yoga routines can help lift your spirits. Yoga will make you feel much better at the end of a session. Try it and you'll find that you can beat the blues with yoga. Individuals who want to improve their strength, posture, and overall health must include deadlift exercises with yoga in their fitness program. This exercise is an integral component of a strength development program that virtually works every muscle in the body and emphasizes hips, thighs, buttocks, lower back, the shoulders, and the forearms. These body parts are the postural chain of the body and are essential for maintaining proper posture. The deadlift is taught by fitness experts to people who want to increase their level of strength and muscle mass. The deadlift is one of the best exercises for improving one's physique, especially if that fitness goal wants to be attained in just a short period of time. The best thing about this exercise is that it does not require any fancy gadgets and equipment. All one needs is a barbell and a flat surface. The barbell can be loaded with as much weight as one can handle and pick it off the ground while keeping the back straight. The deadlift also has possible rehabilitation benefits. Research has shown that the moderate to high hamstring activity performed as part of a deadlift routine may help strengthen the anterior cruciate ligament during rehabilitation. The movement of this exercise translates well into real life because it can be likened to bending and lifting. However, unsupervised and incorrect execution of deadlifts may cause injury. It is important to consult a doctor before engaging in high-intensity exercises like the deadlift. If you liked our content don't forget to hit like and subscribe button. Thank you for watching.